This is Ben's stuff. Ben, we're back again, and we're back with the original robots we started with the kick off our channel that made us who we are today, the Now Robots. Yeah. Now, we're going to go over all of our robots, so each week we're going to start posting a video of every robot that we have, yeah. and we're going to tell you about the things we like and don't like, or things they can add to help improve the robots that you'll be watching. Mm. So... Usually when you get a new robot, you're all excited and you're like, yeah, 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 it's great. Right? And you, you don't see any flaws. No, you don't. Because but it's your first time seeing it, right? That's right. But after a while, we, you have your robot, you're like, man, I wish you could do this. I wish you could do that. Mm -hmm. So we're going to tell you where you can get these robots, right? Yep. Some places you can't buy them from the website anymore. Mm -hmm. Some places you have to find it on secondhand stores. Mm -hmm. Like I, eBay. I someone, yeah, eBay. Yeah, eBay. You can get them there. Robot and stuff shop. Like that. Robot shop? Yeah, I guess so. So I'm going to try to list what I can and what I know in the description if you want to get your robots. But we're going to tell you right now about these ones. Yeah. So we have other videos that tell you what now is about. And we've turned them on and played with them. But Ben, you're going to turn them all on now. Yep. Okay, I'll start and then right. we'll kind of like tell you, hey, you know, you know what's good about these nows? Or you know what would be better? That's what we're going to get to. I think that's important because when people are going to buy something, because if they buy it secondhand, they're like, well, what do I need to know? Yeah. Uh oh, is that one not even turning on? Oh, it's okay. Try turning on the other one. Okay. I think we put the battery wrong in that one. Probably, yeah. yeah. Okay. So let's just wait for these ones to turn on for now because I want everybody to see them turn on. Yeah, we can maybe do that, guys, like him yeah. sitting down. I'll hit, I'll hit pause after they stand up. And then uh, we'll see what's wrong with the battery in the back. Yeah. Okay, so now robots, expensive. Yeah. Right? They're expensive. They're, they're not cheap. They're not cheap, but they're not as expensive as they used to be. No, they, they go down as they make new models. Yeah, and the long, yeah, the older they are, the cheaper they get. But that's the thing, too. You can't buy these ones through the company. You have to get these ones secondhand because these are all V5s, right? Yeah, I don't think they sell V5s anymore. I don't think so either. I think that's like an eBay type of thing. Yeah, now they sell V6 and 6 yeah. AI. Yeah, V6s, some with AI. So one of the good things I think about this for nows is, is if you get Zora and put that on, it's very easy to use because you're just clicking buttons and you can make it dance. Yeah. With can... Without Zora... Well, it's, you just kind of, well, you can either talk to it or you can kind of like program it. It's almost like broccoli. Yeah, so you have like, a comes with a program called Choreograph mm -hmm. and you got a code in Python or you can click and drag stuff they already have in it, kind of like broccoli, like you said. Yeah. But it's difficult and yeah, you have to have a laptop and you have to connect it with Zora. You just type in the IP address and then boom, that's the end of it. Yeah. So... Good thing is if you have Zora, so you would have to check that out from ZoraBots. You got to do like, you got to take off the head, I think, and something. You got to look at the uh, IP or something. Yeah, I believe in the back, behind the battery, there's a number that tells you about the, the model number. And then underneath the head, it shows you a model number. So you have to give that to them. And I don't think that's cheap either. I think that's expensive as well. I can't remember how much it was, but I'll but put I the link. We got it. Oh, we got one going. Good morning. Please put me in an open space on the floor and touch my head door, my plumber, so uh -oh. I can wait uh -oh. <laughs> They're all kicking in. Nice. Oh, Red's standing up. Oh. Let's stretch him. Good morning, now. Oh, my goodness. That always makes me so nervous seeing stuff like that. Because if you if you pay for a robot, let's say you pay like whatever five, six, ten thousand dollars or whatever it is for robots, and then you see it do that, you're like reaching, you're like, oh my goodness, I'm so scared. Oh, is it stand back up? All right, so we got the blue one standing up. We have the red one standing up. I think we need to double tap him here. Oh, there we go. Now he's standing up. All right, so we got them all standing up. We told you what was kind of cool. What's kind of like a disadvantage, obviously the price, but you're paying for like so much. Like you're paying for like awesome quality here, right? Yeah. So it, it is it is worth the money. But 
some things that need to be improved. What do you think? Do you have any ideas? Well, I think what they should improve, and they might do it on if they make a V7, mm -hmm. they might they might um, make the hand uh, fingers less flimsy. Yeah. Because it's like inside, it's one very thin metal wire. Okay. And that's the only thing that's like making it move, and it can easily snap off. So just have stronger fingers, I guess. Yeah. Not so flimsy. So let's take a look at the ones right here. Maybe you can show the one that's off. That way you can yeah. move them easier. So like here. Um, so you can kind of just open it here. And then you see that wire right there in there? Oh, yeah. That's what. That's the, pretty much the only thing that's holding it. It's probably just glue or something. You think it's glue? <laughs> glue or something. Uh, they probably do something a little bit more high quality than just having glue. But yeah, yeah. Obviously the, the fingers, sometimes they stretch out, right? They don't go back into place. Yeah. So I'm not too sure about that. Yeah, so the improvements could be the fingers. I think the joints. I think that's a big thing is these motors that are inside. They're strong. They are strong. I So back a while ago, guys, when I was showing the, one of the now robots, when Ben only had one, I picked it up and then I think its arms or its legs squeezed together and it pinched my hand and I was like, ah! And it hurt. It it's really did too, hurt. It's a little too strong. Yeah, so you do have to be careful with robots, guys. If you get something like this, be careful because you never know. Like, it doesn't know it's pinching your finger. No, it doesn't. It has, no, it has no idea. So, what else could we do to now? So, oh, I think I was going to say the motors. I think the motors need to be I think a better quality, maybe, or because well, they seem to burn out. Or, yeah, they, they're good quality. But once you use them for like a long period of time, eventually their motors are going to start like, my motors are overheating and then... Yeah, that's right. And, and if, the battery life. But mind you, you're playing it like forever. Yeah. yeah, and the battery life. So yeah, so if you got an now robot, what would be cool is if they sent you like a secondary battery just in case, you know, you could have one charging and the other one playing and then if it dies, just swap them out because it's only two screws. Yeah, and there's a lot of things that the battery needs to power. Look like, at the red guy. He's looking at you and the blue guy. They're both doing the same thing. All right, so I'm going to hit pause real quick. Okay. Let's fix the battery in the back of that guy. Let's see if we can get him to stand up, okay? Okay. That's okay. All right, so <laughs> we put the battery in and out. I, I think we don't. I think we forgot to charge that one. Yeah, probably. But anyways, so you saw them all there, and man, they're again, the cool factor of now robots are just awesome on their own. Even if you could find one, let's say this one didn't work at all, mm -hmm. right? You couldn't turn it on. Just having that would be cool. Yeah, just having that at your house. If there's a way that like you if could. If your just, friend comes over, he's like, "What is that thing?" Yeah, because look, it just sits nice. Like there's no, it's not on. It's sitting there without any power. So it's a great display model. Obviously, it would be cool if it worked or if the lights turned right. on. Oh yeah, for sure. Yeah, because look at it, the, the lights on it and everything. It's super cool. But if it, if it didn't, you might be able to get it cheaper if you find like a now robot that's broken for parts. Mm -hmm. You could just get one of those and just have it on display, probably super cheap. And if you're handy, mm -hmm. you probably could fix it. Who knows? I don't, some guys out there. If you just, know how to do that kind of stuff. Yeah, but. some people out there know how to get that broken stuff and just like repair it to brand new. So that's a cool talent right? if you can do that. All right, so anything else about now robots? So let's think. We did some things about what we like, what we don't like, what needs to be improved. What, what is there anything they should take away? Is there anything on the now robot you're like, man, they didn't need that? Um, unless it really does use it, I don't really notice it. But I'm gonna say either these sensor thingies here, whatever these are, yeah. or this. Yeah, you don't. I you... think it only uses this as a camera. Oh, the one camera, because it says it has two cameras, right? Mm-hmm. Yeah, yeah. I don't. I don't know anything about that. I think that a downfall is the the server that you plug it into now. If you have a V5 or V4, yeah. I don't think they offer the server to install all the stuff on your now robot anymore. No. No, because if you go on there, you can't just say, "Follow me," or you, you know how. You, yeah, because they don't. You can't get on the the website to copy all the coding over for English and everything. That's weird. Yeah, unless they fix it, like... They're probably I, working on it. They're probably updating it or something. Yeah, maybe. I have no... It was down for a while, so I have no clue. So, guys, if you're going to get a now robot, okay, mm -hmm. if you're going to actually spend the money and go on eBay and get one, please, please, please go on the website 
and do your research. And I'm going to say this for all our robots. Do your research. Make sure you check about, you know, what the price is. Like, what's the going price? Make sure you check to see, is it still worth getting one of these? Like, is is the company still making updates, right? Yeah. Maybe, maybe your robot needs to be connected to a server and the server is down. And then you can't use your robot ever again. So these are things that you have to do your research on, guys. We can only yeah. tell you so much, but it's up to you before you spend your money to make sure that you know what you're getting. So please use Google, chat GPT, do whatever you got to do to find out your information. Mm -hmm. But we can tell you one thing for sure. Now robot is pretty, pretty cool. Yeah, it's definitely cool. Can you get them? Does any of them have voice right now or no? I don't think so, no. The, just the one has Zora on it, right? Think, I think it's either, I think it's this one or this one that has Zora, but I don't think it's working right now. Yeah. All right, so let's get, take the red guy. Let's put him between the two blue ones that are on. Okay, let's just move this guy out of the way. Yeah, okay. We got to charge that battery. It would look cool to have all four of them, but that's okay. So put the red guy in the middle, and then you're going to get them all to stand up. We'll put them in the middle first before yeah, you stand them up. I'm just going to stand them up so then I can oh, okay. move him. Yeah, yeah, oh. yeah. Oh, oh, the volume's cranked on that guy. Yeah, for real. Yeah, look at that. That's a cool picture right there, guys. Here, let me go right here so they all look at me. Oh, look at they're all looking around. What's up? He's not looking at all. No, I think it's because he has Zora on. Oh, maybe that was that was that one that Zora? I guess so. <laughs> Who knows? But it's so cool, guys. I hope you enjoyed this video. Yeah. There's, I don't know, I don't know what else to say about this guy. Like this is, mm. yeah, like it's so cool. And th these guys have been out for a long time. Yeah, they've been out for... I don't know I how many years. I think they said for like 2009 or something. Really? That yeah. long ago? And, that, and that's crazy. And that long ago, and these robots still blow away some of the robots that are being made today. Like, they're just amazing. Mm-hmm. Like, yeah. Softbank Robotics. You and, did amazing at this. Yeah, they did... Everybody did a good job. Like, I don't know. Oh, listen, as Aldebaran... Softbank Robotics, I think Robot is Labs, I, like all these, all these companies have some kind of like tie to the ro now robot. They're just taking over. Yeah, <laughs> yeah. I really, I really hope that they. Oh, that's what I was gonna say. The mini ones, they should bring those back for people. Oh yeah, they Let's, should. Where are they? Do we have them they're, around they're here? They're upstairs. Okay, I'm gonna hit pause. You go get them, okay. and we'll show them. Okay. Okay. All right, Ben. Thanks for getting them. Yeah. So these are the little now robots. They don't do anything, but you can move their arms and their legs and their head, and you can pose them in different positions. Yeah, like I just kind of got that in that. And, yeah, look, they're it's exactly the same. They're they're they, identical. Yeah. There's a red guy. And there's a red guy. And if you wanna, and if you wanna see a size oh. comparison, let's go. Oh. Yeah. So if you have one of these, that's what it would look like yeah. next to it. And you can see the size difference. So it goes like right to the kneecap. And that's how small they are. But they're super cool though. They can put them on your desk or wherever you want to put them. That's what they need to bring back. They need to take time to be like, you know what? Maybe people can't afford a now robot. But they'd love to have the little action figure. I bet you there's lots of kids out there like you. Growing up being like, man, now robots are amazing. Right? Yeah. That's what you were like. You're like, man, I want an L robot. And look at, I don't know. We got four I don't now. even know how this happened, but it happened. But you got, you started off by getting these little guys first. I think you got the blue one first, and then you got the red one. No, I think I actually got the red one first. Really? Yeah, I got the red one first. Do you, do you even know if there's any other colors, or are those the only two? Red and blue. Is this red and blue? So there you go, guys. Who, so whoever's in control of now edition. robots, make the miniatures. Because I bet like, you people want them. They already came out with the 6AI. Work on these guys. Yeah. Yeah, just make the miniatures. They must have a molding somewhere. Man. Anyways, yeah. So that's definitely a must-have is those miniature guys if you can't get the big one. Because yeah. I remember you used to play with those little guys all the time. 
you even fell asleep with one of them in your arms. Yeah. Like, that's yeah. how much you love those little things. And I bet you kids would love them, too. So let's please bring those back. Mm -hmm. And I think we already talked about Zora. We talked about the good and the bad. Really, the whole thing's good. There's, like, There's one or two things bad. Yeah, and they're not... Well, then it's not Everything even that bad, because the price was, like, one of the things that was a downfall, but... Yeah, like... But you're well, it, for the it's ma it makes sense. Like, these things are amazing. Yeah, yeah. Absolutely, they are. Okay, guys. Well, thanks for watching. Yeah. I think what what video are we going to do next? Let's try doing... Let's go the next down in price. Okay. Let's go to oh, what is Misty, it? right? Misty yeah, would Misty. be the next one down. All right, okay. so, guys, after this one... Gonna do we're gonna, I'm going to post this one so you guys are watching this one and next week we'll have one about Misty mm -hmm. and we'll talk about the goods, the bads what we like, what we don't like what they should get and what they should remove Yeah. so we're kind of going to do that with all the robots yeah mostly this whole month and probably next month is just going to be videos well I think we have 50 robots somewhere around 50 so that means 50 weeks of robots so guys Get, Get your popcorn. <laughs> We're going to have a video every week. We're going to make sure. It's almost a year's worth. Wait, how many? There's 52 weeks in a year. So that's like two weeks less. Yeah. Oh, we'll, figure, we'll figure something out, maybe. Yeah, that's almost a year's worth of videos. Holy moly. You, Get ready. Yeah, yeah, that's a lot of robots. All right, guys. I'll try to do it my best to put links. And remember, please do your own research before buying a robot. Yes, yes. I don't yes. want you guys to be watching this and be like, oh, well, Ben has it. And then you get yours, you're like, what do you mean it doesn't do that? <laughs> Just, yeah, make sure you do a lot of reading. Yeah. All right, guys, do what do you want to do. Do you want to do anything with them before we go? No, I think we're good. You think you're good? All right. Unless you want to uh, stand all of them up for a last looker here. Yeah. Oh, look, he's looking at me. Mm. Oh. Yeah, they're all standing up, except for that poor guy back there. I'm sorry. It's all right. We'll charge you up. We'll charge you up. But that's cool, though. Man. I can sit here staring at them all day, just Good. watching them move around. As long as their motors don't. Yeah, yeah, you're gonna we'll be careful with the motors. All right, guys, see you on the next video next week with Misty. Yep. And, and get ready for those fifty weeks of videos. Fifty weeks of videos, baby. Bye. Bye.